The baboons are free to enter a testing booth and take part in an experiment whenever they want. They are identified by a microchip implanted in their arms, so a computer launches the appropriate experiment for a given baboon. Here we see inside the testing booth where there is a touch screen for presenting stimuli and recording responses and a food dispenser for delivering a reward after a correct response and that's the noise that you can hear. And here we see a baboon performing, performing our experiment, first touching the stimulus to initiate a trial and then touching the plus sign if the stimulus is a non-word and the oval shape if the stimulus is a word. So this is not real reading, this is pre-reading. They're identifying patterns. And it's similar in a way, not just to the early steps in reading and identifying patterns in words, it's also the way we identify patterns in life as for babies and children. Um, it, they think it's the same part of the brain that identifies these patterns, that figures out a table is a table as opposed to the difference between a table and a rock. To those of us who aren't paying attention, it's very surprising. To the people who are, it's, a, it's another step.